Hello viewers, I believe you are enjoying your weekend. I still remain your able presenter, Hakunde Dokkans. On your favorite TV show, Let's Talk, on Omobini TV, yeah. on a more serious note. On a more serious note. And I'm here with my cute, pretty <laughs> co-presenter. Oh my god, I'm blushing. Uh -huh. I'm blushing in pink. <laughs> I'm happy for you. Okay. Thank you, thank you. Hello, viewers. My name is Bada Elizabeth Lotomisi, aka Lizzie. And don't forget, it's still your favorite show. Let's talk. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, this morning we'll be discussing a topic we all are familiar with, but we just need to refresh your memory on that. And the topic is bullying. 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 I know you all know that bullying, but wait, what is bullying? To you, what is bullying? To me, what is bullying? Now, let me just define my own term, what bullying means. Bullying is the use of force, of threats, or say abuse, aggressively to dominate or to intimidate. So whenever you hear bullying, three things should be in your mind, that it comes with force, it comes with abuse, and it comes with what? Threats. People tend to threaten you. And also, bullying is intended to alt human. It's intended to alt a person, an individual, either physically, emotionally, or mentally. Now let me stop here. What's your own view on bullying, Tosin? Well, actually the word bullying has been as in has been occurring day by day. Most especially in schools worldwide. To so me, bully is generally, generally sort of as intentional, things we do intentional, harmful behavior which is carried out repeatedly, yes, repeatedly, yes, okay. to make that person feel, I, mean, I want to harm you to the core, mm. to make that person feel sad, I think we want that person to have a low self-esteem, that whenever mm. this person see me, I want him to yeah. see the fear, I want to see yes, the fear yeah. in him. Yeah. Yes, that's what bullying is all about. Wow, wow. Yes. I love that. I love the definition. Thank you for that. Okay, welcome. Before we continue. Okay, actually, our viewers, yeah. before we continue, before we go deeply into today's topic, we're going to go on a short break. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Don't touch that down. Welcome back. It's to your favorite TV show, Let's Talk on Omobini TV. Yeah. Yeah. Now, we're talking about the types of bullying. Usually, we just talk about four types of bullying today, which are the verbal bullying, social social bullying. We have physical bullying, and we have and also cyber. The cyber. Oh, thank yeah. you. So we're just discussing those for today. I know you know the rest. Yeah. So what is verbal bullying? As it said, verbal. Verbal is saying or writing mean things. Saying or writing mean things. Mean things such as what? Such as teasing, name calling, inappropriate sexual comments, threatening one another. You know, there are some people that will just be there, like verbally, the way they talk alone, they, they, they tend to threaten someone that if I should see, if you should pass through my street again, you'll be dead. And I mean it. That is example of verbal oh, bullying. bullying. Okay. Now, to talk on social bullying. Social bullying involves what? It involves altering someone's reputation or relationship. Mm -hmm. Reputation or relationship, such as what? Spreading rumors about someone oh my god some people are so good at this they don't even they, they, they don't even always wait to get the real information they're just there do you know what the cast did yesterday i saw with that guy and i saw like the way they will package the information they spread rumors of what they know nothing about another thing is what embarrassing someone in public some people are just so good in that embarrassing someone in public that's what we call social bullying okay yeah right to so me we'll be talking about cyber bullying yeah and this has become increasingly popular as our opportunities 
for networking in Greece. Yeah, that's true. Yes. Because 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 of the publicity that social um, excuse me, social media permanent see. Okay. Um, that it affects us as an everyday because the, the the cyber bullying, most especially when it up it occurs between our teams. Yes. Because we know most of them, they are not really as they don't know how to handle issues mm -hmm. when it comes to maybe I'm having an issue with you. Okay. I'm underage, right? Okay. We have issues. They don't need to talk to you directly, yeah. and you, instead of us to address it as mature minds, yeah. I just go to the social media. You know, I just talk about this person, and in fact, I actually tag the person I'm talking about, okay. and that alone has actually affected the person's image. Because okay. many people, those people that know me know her and even those that don't even know us they know what is actually happening between us and which is very bad and it can also lead to depression and anxiety mm. so that's all what cyberbullying is all about i just want to change something in that okay what a video it's part of it let's, uh, let's just assume maybe a, a guy and a, a girl maybe they had sex together and they video it. each other yes. uh, maybe like weeks after they're no longer interested with each other i'm gonna use that against you and before you know they will upload it on the internet and image yeah i love that I actually love that. you know bullying is very serious a very serious topic we need to look into especially in schools yes students because yeah. yeah in the school you know your parents are not there nobody's yeah. there your sister the senior ones are not there so it tends to happen right in the school and which is very very bad and we need to look into it. Okay, thank you. I really love that point to see. Now the fourth one is physical bullying. Physical bullying it involves what? A person, it involves hurting a person's body or possessions. Hurting the person's body or possessions. Such as what? Eating, pushing, taking what doesn't belong to you. Destroying what doesn't belong to you. Now when we are talking about cyber Bullying. Something just came to my mind. You know this bullying majorly it affects, it affects the students. Teacher can tend to, to bully a, a, a student and like if you should tell your parents you are in for it. You know that bullying leads to a lot of things. It leads to rape, it leads to depression, a lot and a lot of things. And that it also a, affects the academic process. Yes, yes. At the point like lecturers tend to bully students that if he didn't give if he didn't give in to what I just said, you know now carry over. Alright. Actually viewers, yeah. right about now when you go to the market, we'll be right back. Stay tuned. Still your favorite TV show, Let's Talk on All Mogini TV. Now, I have an experience on physical bullying. Okay. I remember back then in secondary school, I went to a boarding school. Then our senior would be just be in the room, gisting, talking, giving us some stories. And before you know it, oh, though guys, can you just get me your cup? Alright, senior, hey. Can you just get me your cornflakes? Okay, senior, take. Get me your milk, your milo. And she's really taking everything I have, and I can't say, but you know, this is not yours now. It's it's mine. You know that fear alone. You no, you can't even dare it. I don't even have the confidence to go and tell the principal right. because you. Know, do you know what happens to you? Is the principal sleeping in the hostel with you? No, you'll be the one sleeping in the hostel. The next thing is you kneel down till daybreak, or you receive massive beating by our friends, like. They will derive joy in thinking what doesn't belong well, to them. I would them. like to ask you a question. Okay. So when this happened, like it has been happening steadily, why did it report it to your parents? <laughs> my parents, do you know automatically if I should report to my parents? They're taking it to the school authority. Mm -hmm. School authority will take it up from there. They will call those involved and myself to explain what happened. Mm -hmm. I will still be the one to receive that. We're still going back to that same hostel, even if they'll be suspended for 
some weeks. They return back to school. So sin, I'll be punished. I was not even I'll be punished. I was punished. Actually, I don't know the behavior you put up when you're in school. But if it was me, I'm very sure anybody can even bully myself. Confirm myself, go I'll be pretty. So, okay, anyways, let, 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 let's just end that. So, like, seriously, hmm? it's just really bad. Nobody can bully me. I'm very sure of it. Okay. Assuming I were in your shoes then, then. they were here. Ah, uh, but not now. No one can bully me now. now. Yeah, that was uh, then. Yeah. Uh, you guys are just a get Yeah, I mean, school. boarding school now. First day where they leave my parents. Oh, that's for <laughs> All right, children. now, there are some risk factors. Yeah. Risk factors in bullying, okay. such as low self esteem, low self -esteem. And lack of confidence. Mm -hmm. A lot of people lack confidence. Now, how can, we re how can people reduce their risk for being bullied? Now, what we have to do is we have to what? We have to build up people's uh, confidence. Yes. We have to build up their what? Confidence. Yeah. So, yeah, to you viewers, I think we all enjoyed today's lecture. Yes, I'm going to call it a lecture because we are actually giving out information. We are teaching you some things about bullying. And we are also teaching you to, stay, to say no to bullying. Try to build your self esteem. Be always confident. And wherever you go, whatever you do, always be confident so nobody can bully you. So, yeah, if you think you can relate, you can actually like our page, share, and also subscribe to our YouTube channel. Omo Bini TV and on IG and Twitter Omo Bini Blog and of course on Facebook Omo Omo Bini TV dash O B T V and don't forget to download our app on Play Store Omo Bini TV dash O B T V yes and for advert placements WhatsApp messages or call you can actually call this numbers on your screen zero eight one. 0972 7784 or 081 30 I don't, don't forget, forget it's your favorite show. Let's talk on Omobini TV. On the